Buddy, hope you guys are having an absolutely wonderful morning, day, evening, or night, wherever you are. We are back with week two of Pick a Pack Yu Gi Oh! Season 1. And just when you guys look at the screen, you can tell. Doing stuff in the Varane's era is wildly different. Oh my god. I feel like I completely redid my deck. But maybe that's because Psychic isn't like the go to strategy for like three weeks in a row. But. As always, through this pick a pack Yu Gi Oh journey, I am joined by my co host, Blade Wolf. Blade Wolf, how are you doing? Hello, hello. A bit tired, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to get an easy dub anyways. It won't matter. Understand I don't need to play well to win this. Oh my gosh. I really hope. Depending on how your polls go, this series is going to be incredibly lopsided one way or the other way. We just don't know how it's going to go. Um, Depending on how my polls go, I'm ready to special summon a 2700 guy until the end of time. That That's the plan. You know what? If, if you can special summon it till the end of time, I think I will in fact die. But if I can even get maybe just like a couple turns of you just like, if I can get like two turns of setup maybe, I think, I think my deck is, Ooh, I think my deck is uh, some gas going for it. Feeling very solid about it. But to summarize for people who are just tuning in. Every week, Blade Wolf and I decide on two packs from a given year of Yu-Gi-Oh! and we each get half a box of that set. We open it up, we add it to our card pool of progression styles, and we keep doing this week to week. It is the first to a best of seven, so maximum of seven weeks. First person to four wins wins the series. Currently, we are on week two, and Blade Wolf took the first week by um, very, very good pulls, very good deck building, me severely underestimating how limited looks between different series. I was like, I'm gonna go infinite with my crawler spines and my crawler axons. Nah. Nah, that was not the move. But with that, Blade Wolf ended up taking five extra packs of Circuit Break from the first week. And because I lost, I ended up getting five extra packs of Soul Fusion from this week. So the packs for this week was from 2018. Yeah, 2018. And we got Extreme Force and Soul Fusion. So that's what we're playing off for this week. Blade Wolf, you ready to hop into some games? I suppose so. Alrighty. Oh my god. I'm so worried about how this could go one way one way or the other. You, sh you should be less worried. My polls were not good. Besides what you already know. The 2700 boys. The but lads. Those are already good guys. But the room is now up. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh is it? It is. I'm like... I'm like, I'm like secretly worried that if my po if my deck doesn't win this week, I'm like, I just don't know how to build for a series like this. But good luck and have fun. Oh my god. God, I wonder what I'm doing here. You know, could be anything. Well, for those of you who are not aware, Soul Fusion is the set that does introduce the one and the only Dino Wrestler Pankratops. So I am actually worried for just my life of if I summon any Simply guy. don't summon anything. I, I simply won't kill you. I will not summon three Ascendant of Thunder and simply kill you. I'm just going to set two and pass. Can I pretty please ask you to not have triple Ascendant of Thunder? Uh, well, if you say pretty please, I can't not, I guess. Excellent! Set one monster and anything else? And a back row. Two back row? So, even well, two set cards. Only one back row, and this is an incredibly powerful card. I need to do this to do some shenanigans. Just because I think this is going to be so cool. But I'm going to Pop use your own card. Oh, okay. Discarding my world dino wrestling to target your back row. And now, because you control more monsters than me, I can banish from my graveyard World Dino Wrestling in order to add from my deck to my hand the only... No, I special summon? My bad, I will special summon directly from my deck. One copy of... Oh, like it changed the Dino name. Wrestling! Yeah. Hey, tops. You're right, it doesn't change anything. I just uh, didn't realize that was what it did. Um, unfortunately, I don't have anybody else to commit right now, so I just gotta go to battle phase. And Pankratops is gonna do a pinking- You should tribute your Pankratops here. That's what you should do. I am- I am making sure to be ve- Ah, uh, shoot. It doesn't matter. Nothing matters. Truly the illusion of choice. I mean, this is not ideal. 
because that was like my cool thing. Uh, no, I asked myself the same question. Do I just die to Pankratops? <laughs> you don't die to Pankratops. <laughs> okay, now you die to Pankratops. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Just dying to Pankratops. Uh, yeah, I mean, I can't not. It's the boy! P -p -p Pankratops! We will go... The real question is, who else do we have out here? Oh, the launcher commander. We're just summoning some boys. Uh, do he we believe in pop. spine? He does only pop. To be honest, if you want to spine my Pankratops, like, you know, go off. Yeah. Yeah, wanna spine? Alright, yeah. sick. Like... Launcher Commander here is like a guy, but like it's it's pink. Uh, <laughs> Ooh, we got a damage step trick. Notable thing is that there no. are a lot of damage step tricks nowadays. Uh yeah, we, we pop pink a million ways on Sunday. We got the Launcher Commander. <sighs> I think I just make you do it, right? No, I don't. I want to, but I can't. Ooh, we got another one. Ah, and the burden of the mighty. That's always a tough one. Um, let's see if we can use our out for it, though. We will scale. Yeah, I think, bur yeah, burden of the mighty is just so powerful. It gives Pankratops minus 700 attack points. Yeah, we go Archfiend Eccentric. And we will use Archfina Centric to pop the burden. Yep, seems good. And now, special summon, Pankratops! Alright. Let's see what that back row is. Attack. Don't activate. <clears throat> Attack. As long as it's not a damage step trick, Pankratops is able to dodge it. But yeah, literally we know it's a damage step. So which one are we? We're looking at Clash. All right, Clash is not the worst though, because I can still, as soon as Launcher Commander comes, I mean, either you pop Pink or Pink pops it. Um, I, I, mm -hmm. Either way, they're going to end up trading here, which is part of what makes Pink's are top so good. Uh, during the end phase, no, I'm good. Uh, so we've managed to maintain card parity somehow. And by card parity, I mean in the... No, no, no. I think we... Yeah. Yes. Even though we went first people on the Benner Zap team, we have managed to make it three to three cards, and we're the ones with the next drop. Yeah. Yeah. Um... Yeah. You don't control any cards. So like... All right. Um, do we open ourselves up to another pink? I, I think we just do. <laughs> we set one to pass. <laughs> Sick. Oh, a back row. Mm -hmm. And you have two back row. Well, to match your two back row, I have two monsters. Incredible. What are we trying to do here? Um... Dun, 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 dun. Oh my word, that's triple back row. <laughs> oh boy, uh, we don't have torrential in the format. But we do have break off trap hole, and I do have normal summons which immediately link. So I can sack oh, yeah, my we, normal and a break wait, off have, to clear have, the hole. We have link one, uh, we have link one cybers, right? We have, uh, we have um, the link one world chalice. For any normal monster, yes. uh, including our 2k normals. But we also have Nimble Beaver and Clock Wyvern for the Link 2s. Right. We will flip summon our Crawler Dendrite and use its All effect. Right. What is this? This is. This is the Foolish Send a guy. Wheel. Sure. 
and we shall send to the graveyard one copy of our World Shield. You are doing World Shield shit? All right. All right. What? It's... I'm going to summon Pank you now, right? Pank doesn't out World Shield. Uh, every time you summon World Shield, I can summon Pank back, and I can out something else. I will simply deprive you of everything that is not World Shield. You can pay 1,000. Oh. Oh. Huh. You know what? We might just we might just let that one sit in the back row for a little while then. Which is something that we can just do. Oh, you have three back row and you're on eight. I guess what do we have? We have the biggest one would probably be Wall of Disruption is the biggest one to punish a massive swing. It's the biggest one to punish like three wide, but if you want to go tall into a link, then it doesn't punish super hard. Yeah, unfortunately, punish is pretty hard still. Actually, going tall into a link here. We're just going. We're just going a little wide. Because we have our... Ooh. We have our one copy of Thunder. Alright. We're just gonna we're just gonna try to push for 4k here, I think. Um, I think there's technically an order card. I forget what the order card wants. I think it's small than big. Most most order cards, I think, are small than big, anyways. But maybe I, I could just be completely wrong. Of course, I have owned myself up to the awkward position of what if you just banish my Ascendant of Thunder, then I'm in a bit of a spot of trouble. This is... Yeah, we'll do this right here. Yep. Wall of Disruption. Knew that one was coming down. Gonna have to get in for the the, the 300 devilage. <laughs> I don't think there's any one guy that can just walk over Dendrite and kill me right now, so... As, uh, as sketchy as it seems... <laughs> I think I exist at least a little bit longer. Back to the front. Pank. Pankertops. Panky tops. I am looking to kill you here. Understandable. Normal summon any guy uh, with what? Uh, 1,000 attack. Any guy with 1,000 attack. Yep. That, uh, that seems about right. Yep, throw him into attack position. Well, unfortunately, I did not get any guy with a thousand attack. So... Hey, let's go. <sighs> you have to two common. If this card leaves the field because of an opponent's card effect, I am not leaving the field by an opponent's card effect. So that just happens. <laughs> you wanna damage step your I'm zero attack thinking... guy? Cause what? That would Nah. Do I do you? No. Looking at another back row? No. Oh, what are we looking at here? Would you like to walk in with your Send to Thunder, you know, cash in those, those life points? I'm, I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. I'm at 700. You should stop thinking about it. <laughs> um, I know. Uh, you have one back row? I really don't like this, but I think it's the only way to do anything here. We... I guess this... Flip spine? Ooh, that is tasty. Love a, a flip yeah. spine here. We're gonna clash our thunder out of your pink. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it's not So great. I'm gonna lose all the attack? Yeah, sure, dog. Yeah. Oh, it makes it a zero zero. Huh, that's really funny. Um, didn't realize that. Um, flip spine. Pop. All right. Uh, gee, I wonder. I could, I could flip pank here. 
Yes. Like, I mean, I can hear your pank. Please make my spine leave the field because of an opponent's card effect. Shoot. So now we're in the very awkward right. position of you're still in the position where you're attack guys. So with a thousand you. attack, I die over spine. Which is yes. not great to be in. One, Love two, that. Three, uh, you can normal guy link off so you don't have an attack position low with that guy. I'm thinking like about if you it. go into underclock oh, tanker, oh, then I need a 2k guide. Or oh, 1700. Oh, 1700 is too low. You can go into. I'm looking at what else you could possibly have in your back row. Because. If you go into like Snapfist, then I will die. This is a pretty minus play, but it does get my spine off the board. Yeah, alright. And I think just getting spine off the board is like okay here. I think getting spine off the board is the only way you don't die. Yeah. Uh, anyways, Book of Moon, I'll, I'll preserve some life points. Ah, did you not- Oh, you could've Book of Moon my spine! Oh yeah, yeah, for sure. Alright, as far as I know, there's no single normal summon guy that attacks over parry knights right now. So, we're, we need to- so you need to look at making, like, a play. Uh... Normal a guy? Oh, that is a normal summon guy that just outs my guy. Oh, I get it so much value! No, 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 you're, you're just gonna clash again, and it's gonna be sick. Oh my god. Is it worth using this to save this guy? Because I know you then go Twist Corporate into another Rescorpio. Yeah, I just I just let it happen. At least Ascended to Thunder still holding down the fort. <laughs> yeah, this is where my this is where my card advantage is about to a mega go away. Battle. Yep. Yeah. Get in there. There's no reason to let you keep a body on board. There is the chance that you might have re-rolled the Goki Pats, but I don't believe that's what. Oh, you, you, you know exactly what I re-rolled, don't you? Right. I told was, you. Um, it was Circuit Break, which uh, I have a new time. It was the one with Hydrolander. Yes, because you didn't you didn't have enough Hydrolanders as is. Correct. So technically, uh, we can make card this. Parody, except your um, your Scorpio floated into a Twist Cobra, so you still have more guys. Normal guy. Ooh, I mean, I get my life points at least, right? That's yeah, yeah. You get your life price. points. That's not bad. All right, I'm looking for I'm looking for a card. I'm looking for a card. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Give it to me. Give it to me. You got a card. Shoot. Um. Do I Normal, let small. You oh, you're not even top my entire down. field to keep up a world shield. Not yet. I am at 57, so I'm not like dead dead. We don't have a level in catastrophe or heavy storm, okay. so I'm free to set another one. We do have Heavy Storm Duster, but you were already playing into that, so it's okay. Yes. We do, in fact, have to face down the Heavy Storm but it, it did, in fact, impact a large part of my uh, decisions. Meet my Ghost Bird of Bewitchment! Oh! oh, oh. What does this guy do? In He's the left big. most, he gains a thousand attack. In the right most, he can make two attacks on monsters. This is just a normal summon 2300? But he doesn't float, like my other normal summon 2300. Dude, what is Yu-Gi-Oh? What? What in the world is Yu-Gi-Oh? This is what? <laughs> come on, come on, deck, come on, deck. I know, I know, I have some goodies in here. Oh, that's a set. Come on, deck. You can't do this to me. One more swing, is and you're out the, of a sudden. Is this the thunder? part where we let you? Yeah, I think we just have to let this happen. We have, uh, we have gone far enough. Then we can throw down... Um, you already have a monster in this column, I guess, so I'll throw another monster in this column. You can get back any monster of your choice, sir! Uh, this is actually a decision. Mm -hmm. We can make something that outs... Yeah, we can make something that outs the world shield instead of taking pank drops. Uh, we go. We're Duke, looking Duke. at making Ningirsu then. Uh, that is one option. 
hold up. Nah, hold we, up, we can up, just up. take Tank. Tank oh. too good. I was like, wait, what other Link monster outs it? Uh, Agave. Agave outs it. Oh, because Agave can gain 300 if you use a dinosaur? Gains 200 for each dinosaur, aka the one Pankratops. It's a 3200. Well, <laughs> is that another one? Oh, that's a lot of back row. I mean, dust me. <laughs> dust me for my life. So this thing, uh, unaffected by activated effects, cannot be targeted uh, by card effects, cannot be destroyed card by card effects. effects. Yep. What are we looking for here? We're Basically looking for... You could still make Ning your Sue. Go one. Uh, we're looking at a wall of disruption for sure. Like no, no I, doubt. Like look have, at this back row. I just have four back row. It could be literally anything. Uh, I think we can just. Uh, you pay 1,000. You have Clash, you can have what? There's a couple things you can have. You can have Book of Moon. So what we're going to do is we're going to do this. We're going to summon... Twist Cobra. Alright, I'm getting twisty. Can we... No, we absolutely can't do that. Okay, yeah, we'll just go here. Alright, battle phase. Swing in. Alright, what are we looking at? Battle step. Start of damage step. Start of damage. Oh, just kidding, I'm dumb as fuck. Other monsters you control cannot attack the turn you activate this. Guy. Yeah, I didn't read that part. It's okay. So, what are we looking at here? We're looking at me bringing back the shield next turn, and I have to give you back a, uh, like a launcher commander or a Scorpio or another mm -hmm. launcher commander. And with that, so we're you going already have to the make one some twist cobra out. So I, I guess... can also just sack Pank in response to World Shield and get back Pank. Oh yeah, you do just get more pink tops value. I'm pretty into that. You pay, um, yeah, I mean like, a thousand life points is quite relevant here. Before damage calculation. Okay. So we're in damage calc or before damage calc? We're in damage calc already. You can't we're, get out We're of in damage calc, calc already. All right. Yeah. In that case, we can. Or we actually sorry, we're not in damage calc. I did this at start of damage step. Dog, I don't know the parts of the damage step. Before damage calculation. <laughs> Whatever, it's fine. I will just give you another card back. I hate I hate all the different tabs of like oh which part of the day I'm like I wanted I wanted to be like during damage clock I want to have this card hello Cooper Cooper 9080 great to see you all right would you like I mean, to yep. summon world shield well we're yep. gonna do this all right which one are we eating this one my concentrated yeah, all right heart. nice Pankratops! Pankratops is a card! It sure is a card. Set a card, go to end phase. <sighs> I haven't seen all my cool stuff! Well, I've seen some of- like, you've seen the World Dino Wrestling as, like, discard engine, get pink, but... I have more cool stuff too, you know. We go, like... Normal clock. Activate clock. Yup! Uh, we can make you deal damage for each dragon, gain attack for each dino, all monsters your opponent lose attack, and I gain life for each worm. 
Do we have any dinos in the extra? That'd be cool. We really love that. Mm -hmm. Um, that's moderately funny. We can make an Ngirsu. Ngirsu says, "Send one from each." We have to set spend four cards on that, which is rough. Actually, yeah, we have to spend four to make it, and then we have to spend another one after. And then you're just gonna out the agave, and I'll have outed my entire board. Maybe I don't know what you're talking about. Huh? Agave dragon, too good. <laughs> All right, pink pop, popping this one. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's good. One. Okay. Oh boy. Uh, we could make this. Oh wait, does that not work anymore? Oh, alright, alright, that's not legal. So we have to make you first. Oh, that's also not legal. Uh, you can make you. Uh, yeah, we can make you. Alright, so there's Ib. Twist Cobra is getting another uh, Risk Scorp. We already know about that part of the engine. But now you don't have any Link Arrows. Do we need Link Arrows? I don't understand. I'm... Oh, just making Agave. We're making Agave. Alright, so you made it with a... Nothing. Uh, it's not about what you make it with, it's about what's engraved. Oh! Have, are there multiple dinos in Grave? Does it not just count mine? Yeah, it's the Graveyards. Wild. So I didn't need uh, to sack my pink. Uh-oh! <laughs> Shoot! Uh, so we're just trying to get in there. This is really bad. And then you're gonna pay a thousand, and then I'm gonna summon back pink, and then I'm gonna get in there again. This is really, really bad. Ooh! Eccentric! Oh, we're just, we just trying to free roll here? We're, we're trying to kill you here. If possible. Alright, who are we what are we popping? We're popping this one? Mm -hmm. Sure. You could also just let this go. I don't want you to be able to let this go. Oh god! <laughs> it's the Ascendant of Thunder! Oh we boy! Must use a card. Or die. We have one card in hand. Mm -hmm. Alright. I really could use. There's one card that's really good here. Ah, oh, my freaking god! Oh, I'm so upset. 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 You have no idea. Oh my god. Mmm. All right. Big Fact Yu-Gi-Oh. Season one, week two. Week two, game one. Ugh. Uh, All right. Oh, man. Yeah, let's pick that up. Yeah, that's what I thought. Shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. What are you on? You're on Panker Tops, you're on World Shield, you're still on the Crawlers. I don't know what else you're on. I guess you're probably on more Dinos because you've got those Field Spell. Mm -hmm. you, and I need a copy of. Who else was I taking that? I was taking a copy of you. And. No, oh, that's still just good. <sighs> yeah, that was not funny thing. Let's swap this in. Oh, that's okay. Alright. 
Mm, this is acceptable. Man, you didn't. You, okay, I'm, I'm going second. <laughs> I'm going second a million ways from Sunday. Who could have surprised? Who could have believed that? Crazy. You get to go. I'm done. I'm not. I'm um, not going first. Set one, pass. Set one, pass. You like don't have the ascended thunders. So you simply can't kill me. I know. I only have one ascended of thunder. And I'm worried about your ascended of thunders killing me. You should be. So you know what we're up to. Play around pank or play around ascended thunder. One or the other. Set one. And we will special summon Mech Knight Orange Sunset. Interesting. What's this guy do? Um, he's just a mech knight. Summons another mech knight from hand, I guess. All right, he's also three K, but fair enough. And I'll got anything else? One more, <laughs> and then my turn. Incorrect. Illegal. Simply illegal. You have no idea how badly I just want to shame concede right now. I just had to not do that. If I just didn't do that, oh my god. You do know I have the triple heavy stone duster. Um, what can I do here? Very little. I don't have a lot of good ways to out this guy. But I do have one. Go this, this. Hmm. All right. Move, man. Oh! We're looking at like a concentrating current here. Let's target an attack, battle step, start damage step. Yep. It's a one for one. I'm not happy about it. I mean, move bench move! You did get the two for one off the heavy storm duster, because I just played into it. Oh my god. Drop this. I'm so upset on so many levels. <sighs> Are we setting to? No. Well, I do want to kill you. I know. Uh, so we're gonna. Your deck can very easily do that. We're gonna. We're gonna summon a guy. We're getting in there. I'm so upset on so many levels. I think I've already said that already. Have I said that enough? Mm -hmm. I think you have mentioned it, but uh, it's it, it, it's worth repeating. guess this keeps me from dying. I'm at 29. <laughs> it keeps me from dying if this not freaking heavy storm duster. <laughs> uh -oh. oh man. Okay. Oh, normal summon. Yep. What's is the plan? It, is it the duster. Wait, what is one level four lower? You can't summon sunset. I know. Thanks for noticing. It would. Going on I'll, I'll talk about the theory of the deck post game because it was so freaking cool. It was really cool. It just. I don't know. I don't know. It was so cool. It was so cool! Ah! Oh, I mean, we're getting in there. Yeah. Get in there! Attack with the big guy first. Alright. Battle step. Damage step. Clash. 
Target movement. Oh yeah. Yup. That does keep you from being dead. Yup. We have a lot of really cool draws here. We have so uh, many cool draws here. Movement's kind of worthless now. That's that's how it be sometimes. Movement will get his time in the sun next time. We have so many draws here. So many draws. Okay. That does something. That does something. You still have... You're still going to have 10,000 life points. But it does something. It keeps me from being literally dead. So, okay. you know what? We take it. What are we looking at? We take it. This guy's level 7, so he goes down to 19, and you have 2 back row. Who oh boy! Who oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Yeah. Um... We're gonna special summon Paper Tops. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay, we have 2 back row, though. Activate World Dino Wrestling. Okay. This says each player can only attack with one. Mm -hmm. If your dino attacks, it gains some stats. Mm -hmm. You can vanish from greater. Change okay. from arena to defense. Okay. Go battle phase. So now, even if there's a wall of disruption, Pink can still beat over Move Man. He'll be at 21. Yeah, and then he'll lose... He could lose 8? Oh, no, is it... He loses 16. Wall of Disruption does... It drops All the attack position up. monsters, but it's for... No, it drops the attack position monsters for each monster you control. So Zombina is another 800. So Pank goes down to 300 here. Attack. Uh, attack deck. I know... I know the thing is in attack deck. God, I hate the damage stuff so much. Um, if you do concentrating current, what happens? It gains attack equal to its current defense, so it'd go up to 19, so we would still crash? Uh, it would not crash. You're getting the dino wrestling but boost. Okay. Right? So, okay, what else is in the damage stuff? We could be looking at world legacy. Oh, it's true, yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god, I can't even. I can't even. I can't even. I can't even. I can't. <clears throat> I think I just have to actually- I think I actually just have to pop the Ascendant of Thunder. And Sick. I hate, I hate it. I hate it so much. That is... pretty atrocious. Um... The cost is banish it until the end phase? Yeah. Oh, it wouldn't matter if it was cost or effect, right? I'm fine. Because I'm CL2. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm at 19. 19. Nope, I'm literally dead. Yup. <sighs> I'm so upset. Alright, let's do this debriefing. Let's, let's see what, what you're working with. I saw multiple pancreatopses, which is sick because I do not have multiple pancreatopses. Anyways, let me um, let me pull up the Discord screen share. Um, we're here. Share your screen. YGO Omega go live. So let's see. Let me talk through what was happening here. I have triple pancreatops. I have triple World Ooh. Dino Wrestling. I have triple Capitara. I have triple Stegosaur. What the fuck is Stegosaur? Stegosaur is a 1900 normal summon that I never... Why do I see Psychic Snail more than I see Stegosaur? Anyways. Oh, so you summon it off the field spell to add Pankratops to hand. Yeah, you can add a Dino Wrestler or a Pankratops to hand. And then during the end phase... And then it summons it as a Pankratops. It, yes. That's why I'm on triple Zombina. Attack over Zombina, get back Stegosaur... Stegosaur, get either Pinkertops 
or Capitara if I've already gone through all my Pinker Tops. During end phase of attack over, I get back Pinker Tops again. Capitara, if you control more monsters than me, I get to I get to send to graveyard your Ascended of Thunder, so you just lose the 3,000 life points, because it does not destroy. Alright. And then I just then everything else is just good cards. I'm on Triple Clash, I'm on this. These seven. So these seven cards were not my first choice to be the seven cards in the deck. My mm -hmm. first choice in the deck were to be the seven Mech Knights that I have. I have Double Blue mm -hmm. Sky, Triple Orange Sunset, a Move Man, and then a Red Moon. Again, Orange Sunset is not the greatest Mech Knight. It's only a 3k butt. But it is a name to banish for Red Moon to have Red Moon's removal up. So it's like, mm -hmm. it's fine enough to be in. I couldn't main deck them because if I main decked them and you knew I was main decking them, then when I preemptively I play around columns. try to set yeah. up columns, you can preemptively heavy storm duster my back row to make sure my column isn't live. Accurate. So, because it says up to you, so you could just be like, I'm just going to MST the back row, keep your column up. So I had to not run them the first game so that you somehow don't think about that. So as you can see in the second game, I was like, okay, I know I'm going second. I'll bring in all the mech knights. It's going to be great. If I did not run into your Heavy Storm Duster right? and I had the Regeki, because I was sitting on, you know I had the World Dino Wrestling in my hand the whole time. This card is so great to discard off of Regeki mm -hmm. Break. It's not even funny. It's not even funny. You discard it, you get Pink, you discard it, get Stegosaur, Stegosaur, get Pinkertops. Game one I misplayed because I got the Pinkertops directly. I didn't grab the Stegosaur in the first place, so that's definitely on me. But like... Did I, did I build my deck wrong? I feel like this is crazy, isn't it? I mean, it is kind of crazy. You've got some crazy things going on here. You also have a couple, like, like pretty suspect picks, right? Uh, I think the Zombina plan is a bit much. But it's it's like having three more copies of Pinkertops. It's not, because you have to still find Pinkertops first. And you also have to find the other four first, right? Yeah, the, the Stegosaur. Yeah, you have to find two other cards. And, like, you can reasonably find one of them. You can get it off, like, your field spell. You can just draw into one. But, like, getting all three of these cards together, a little sussy. And, like, if you don't do that, we saw, like, what happens with Zombina, right? Like, you can summon, like, a Spine, or that's that's pretty bad. Yeah. You end up not summoning anything. Eccentric doesn't even count. It, the Zombinas can be a little awkward. I guess if I had more launcher commanders, Zombina would be even better, but... Or if I just saw... I didn't see either Stegosaur or Capitara. That is not Either nice. of those yeah, games. Yeah, that's bad. And that Stegosaur so is unbelievable. Nice. I didn't get any Stegosaur. Wild. I also only got one Pankertops. Yes, so... Uh, are you sharing your screen right now? Yeah, yeah, I am. Alright, let me, let me pull it up on the stream so people can see it. Uh, Discord, there we go. Yeah, so we have... Ooh, what's that first card? Oh, Thunder, Thunder Dragon. Dragon Duo. We got a Chaos theme. Uh, sort of. He's my only good dark. There are no other good darks, uh, so I'm not on any... Like, there, there's Ghost Bit Bird. I only have one of it. Wait. Uh, so I can't actually summon it with a dark in deck. So I'm going to make Thunder Clock Taker with Beavers or Clock Wyverns to get a dark in grave if I happen to have Duo in hand. Oh, uh, I see. Using the extra and then, flex into it. And like it's it's clearly like a minus one, because I'm making an underclock taker at an inopportune time. But then I beat over something with duo and I add ascend to thunder to hand. What does duo say again? Uh, when this card destroys an opponent's monster by battle, you can banish one card from your graveyard, add a thunder monster from your deck to your hand. That is crazy. That, that is, is nuts. That is really it is worth nuts. going negative and jumping through hoops to make a link dark monster. Mm-hmm. That is wild, my guy. Uh, it is clearly not one of the better cards in the deck. It is, it is a little bit cope, but luckily it's only one card of cope, so it's alright. Mm -hmm. I can afford one cope. It's not uh, like my the most one cope. You have like a it's a little cope. It's a I mean, like, just a tiny bit of cope. Just a tiny, yeah. tiny, tiny bit. Yeah, I've I, got I, my I one movement. I only have one movement. Board, so. uh, I don't have any red moon. I don't have... Uh, almost any mech knights. I have exactly two, like, yellow star, and no other mech knights. Ooh, yellow star is, like, the worst stat line, doesn't it? Uh, it's not the worst. It, it's... It's alright. It's acceptable. It's better than, like, all the small ones, right? Oh, like, green horizon? 
Yeah, it's better than those. Yeah, Green Horizon is not. Uh, these better. guys are from Forever nope. Go. My one pink tops. These guys are all normal. <gasps> a two clock wyvern. I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, it's just a normal summon 2k guy. Oh yeah, flame, yeah flame administrators. Yeah. I also got a heat. Uh, yeah. I got a Heat Leo, uh, so I could make it out of two Flame Admins, but there are no good main deck fires, which is very awkward. All my Link 3s, which are like decent, I need four monsters to make, so. Yeah. Because, like, Helio's good. It is just spell trap removal, and it's like a decently sized guy. It is it is very nice. If only, if only. Mm -hmm. uh, these are from a forever ago. My one normal summon 2300 Ghost Bird of Bewitchment that's also dark. Love this man. Very cool. Is, I don't understand the flavor. That is a very good pull. That is a very good pull. <laughs> Yeah, uh, forever go, forever go. Same jam, yep, same jam. Week, My week. one herald of the abyss. It's all right. It's removal. Yeah, it, I use it to out your pain stops while I have an empty board or have, whatever. You have so many more life points to play with because you have triple ascended of thunder. Yes. Yeah. My one concentrating current. Oh, you also uh, only have one current. I only have one current. Uh, my one power of the guardians. Kind of oh, nuts, actually. Oh, yeah. Kind of unreal. Is, like really good. What if you don't have spell trap removal? Then this is just fucking the guy crazy. is immortal. Uh, well, not quite immortal because you have some uh, send to graveyard stuff. So mm -hmm. you have capo whatever. Yeah, and I guess I can just pop it with pink before I attack it. Yeah, you can pop the spell trap. Or if you just equip it, I just pop the monster. Yeah, you pop you the monster. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's not crazy. Yeah, I wasn't expecting you to have three pink anyway. So you know, whatever. Yeah. Uh, back to the fronts are that fine. Is you know, you good. I pulled so these were in the old packs. I pulled an extra one out of my bonus five. Oh, that's pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, and these are just for like ascended thunders. Yeah. Tank tops. All, that's all. All of the haunted variants are so good in, this, in these series. Yeah. Uh, break off. I got my second break off trapple out of the bonus five packs as well. Uh, it's yep. all right. It's kind of super conditional. It's like a you spend two cards to usually clear two cards. Like eh, it's all right. Yeah. Uh, these are classic, these are classic. Uh, I got full go Justice for Ryer. Actually good. Yeah. Not not trivial to make, but like he draws cards. He's large. Yeah. He's alright. When you Agave is good. Agave is relevant. Agave is very is relevant. Especially since you're on the guy I should probably have looked into the clock wyverns or like the guys that spam guys. I might have yeah. tunneled too hard on like, oh, this 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 Dino Wrestler Dream is just gonna blow up everything. I mean, the, the Dino Wrestler Dream is pretty good, to be clear. And I have been looking at the packs we can pick from from next week, and I'm like, there's a lot of things I could try to try to support this plan. Okay, that's all. I got nothing. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, I actually, I cited in Showdown of the Secret Sense scroll techniques. I got one of these. It is very funny and very good. Oh, yeah, it's just an it Omni-Negate. It beats Pankratops. It's an Omni-Negate for my second Pankratops. No, not your second, your first. Uh, has just the same name as a card in my graveyard. Oh! Yes, you send as cost. It is now in your graveyard. Oh, oh that's a good point. That's a good I point. I think it works. <laughs> I don't actually know. Um, I, th I think it works too, probably. I activate the effect of Pankratops, and there is a Pankratops It also in beats World Shield uh, and yep. the Field Spell. Yeah. The World Shield is very much my, like, uh, I can't main deck the Mech Knights, I don't think, but... Yeah. Yeah, it, it did not work out the way I wanted it to. Um, what what's with the one of ceasefire? Out of curiosity. Uh oh, I only have one ceasefire, but um, it's four crawlers. If you were on heavy crawlers and it's heavy cope, like I was gonna win anyways, but I figured it'd be funny to win with ceasefire because it uh, like deal it does like not trigger flip effects. Tons of damage. It it flips yeah. all your face down crawlers. Yeah, and notably, you and then I also beat have, over them. You guys. also did pull triple capitera. Like that's not nothing. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all right. They're okay. I only got one field spell, I think, <sighs> and only one Pankratops, and none of the level four that you used to have over there. So. Yeah, the Stegosaur. Oh, I figured I don't have enough ways to get the field spell engraved. It's and I only have one Pankratops, anyways. It's not worth it. Mm -hmm. Man, I need to. I need to revisit the drawing board. Oh, I really, I really. Anyways, anyways, we can. We can let water be under the bridge. I played into Heavy Storm Duster. You do it once and you never do I lost the game to it. I never do it again. You play into Black Rose one time and then you're good for the rest of the season. I'll I'll be okay. Cause again, if I had that Regeki break to discard the wrestling out of the world dino out of hand, would have been able to get the Stegosaur, would have been able to extend it into the 
the guy, would have had it for the Zombina to float into. I completely blew up my entire strategy because I just set another back row. You, you also got Pancratops off the field spell the one time you actually got to treat your field spell engrave. Yeah, that was that was just me not not actually... I, I thought it added to hand instead of special summon. Mm -hmm. Knowing that it's special summon, it's like, oh yeah, you always special summon Stegosaur because then you get another search. Yeah. I assumed you were making the correct play because I didn't know Stegosaur existed. Yeah. But anyways, go ahead and hide Discord there. We still got to go over everything else we pulled. So most notably was yes, my my, my triple pink. I was so I was I was I was so pumped. Unreal. I was so pumped to come in for a win. <laughs> anyways, let me get this uh, the opera capture pulled up here, and then let me. Go I'm pretty the... proud of myself. I beat the 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 triple pink, and like it was relevant. You played a bunch of pink tops every game. <laughs> yeah, that was the that was the goal. Play play all the pinks. Anyways, let's go ahead and share what I, I'm working with here. Uh, oh, got one Zombino, so I have two 2k guys. Um, 2k Normal Summon clearly is not the name of the series at all. We are doing Yeah, I mean, we can summon Mech Knights. The 2k we, guys are not working. We're doing much more powerful things. Uh, um, can you click into the window? Everything's black. Oh. How about yeah, that? there we go. There we go. Um, I think this yeah, guy... Yeah, blocker's worthless. Yeah, this doesn't Terrible. do anything. Um, DD Seeker, if we ever had a chain beat strategy, I think would have been very that, funny. No, I don't. I don't think we ever get any chain stuff. Like that stuff's trapped in the GX era. Yeah, like honestly, this guy just needs like triple torrential tribute, triple needle ceiling. This, that's what this guy needs, and we don't have that. Mm -hmm. But you got Dogman. I do have two Dogmen. That's not bad. I didn't think I needed to play the Dogman because I was like, oh, this strategy is gonna work so good, but. Okay, Maybe. but what if you played a 38-card deck, and you simply dogmaned your way to your Pancratops? Again, this is this is why I'm like... Because the because the time when I... Well, actually, even in the limited series, I guess actually discarding Dogman isn't that bad. Yeah, and then it's, you beat over a guy. It's pretty bad, but it's not that bad. I was just like... My word. Um, you got four Pancratops. Yes, I actually, I have four Capitara. I have two of this guy. This guy isn't good right now, but he is yeah, relevant he's not good. I got a that we too. might open next week, depending on what packs we end up choosing. Just because it ends up extending two level fours. And we have a guy who really likes two level fours coming up. We got four the paper Guska? <laughs> No, someone even better. Oh, I love, the, I love the guy coming up. I love him so much. Um, Triple Stegosaur, we already talked about him. Special summon to the guy. It, when we get to the pack that has Oasis of Dragon Soul, I'm going to be, like, jumping over the moon. I'm going to be so excited <laughs> for that. But then again, so are you, because you have Triple Ascended of Thunder. Anyways. They're large. Um, This doesn't do anything. Uh, no Galaxy Photon stuff. That's just not yeah, what no, that matters. about. Yeah, no, that matters. is funny, but it doesn't two work. Two Bookstone Triple Pencil Plumes. So, like, Too bad they're the bad ones. Yeah. Um, I think this guy... No, this guy doesn't do anything. He's almost playable. Emphasis um, on almost. So uh, you got a bunch blue of sky, mech one indigo, triple orange, one red moon. Red moon, red. Right, the, the red moon's the one that matters. Yeah, of being like all these other mech knights actually do something because they become removal. Yeah, and indigo's okay. The rest are pretty mid. Yeah, because its popping effect is not once per turn. So well. summon a bunch of mech knights. Eventually get a red moon. Of course, it can only pop in the column. But the idea is like you summon it, then you move it with move man, pop another card. Eh. Difficult. Uh, one metal rocket, so not. I don't really That's have that fine. many rockets Whatever. coming together. Uh, only symbol doesn't matter. One symbol skeleton. Actually, symbol is good. You only need one symbol, actually. But you kind of need one of like everybody else. You need triple harp, but you you only need one symbol. You only need one symbol, but you need triple harp. And notably, I have zero harps in this deck. Ah, well. Overtech Quatlis is just Unplayable. like. It just it just doesn't work in the limited series. It really needs the um, the structure deck to get all the banishing dinos. We yeah, you need dino wrestlers don't banish dinos. Um, Falco, yeah, Foxy, got some Jack, Jaguar, and Mir. If if we had like Al if we had a, either Almirage or um, Baylinx, like the Jack Jaguars would go crazy, but we don't, so they don't go crazy. Eh. Uh, triple shell rocket. So you got thunder dark. Oh, you only got one thunder. I got dark. one well. thunder dark <laughs> dragon dark. Best thunder mm. dragon. Best thunder dragon ratio. It's one dark and two matrix. You love it. Very cool. I do have five token collectors. 
You can beat my clock wyverns. So, if you ever think about going too heavy into the tokens, I got I got triple hand traps. I can actually hand trap you. <laughs> um, two for one team if we're trying to be if I was trying to meme around. Uh, two world shields, two world wands. Um, a bunch of tin danglings doesn't do anything. Um, I got my super two Drake's Pelia. I have four nice. agave dragon. <laughs> You only need one. <laughs> I know. I have Curious, which is... You got Curious! Kind of That's nuts. That's crazy. Yeah. I Unbelievable. Just can't do anything with it. You just don't have Harp. Yeah, I just don't, don't have Harp. I you have, got two Galatea? I have... Uh, yeah, I got two Galatea. The Flame Admin's okay. Boy. I have Triple Flame Administrator along with the T-Rexes. I should probably have looked into the Cyber Skies that just make two bodies. Cause... I mean, it's a normal summon 2000 attack guy. That's not very impressive. You can play the 2000 attack uh, normal summons instead. Oh, right? yeah, we have literal normal summon 2000. You, you just get like guys. a teeny bit of extra flexibility in making agave sometimes to get over or something big. And as we've saw, that flexibility in the agave dragon was huge. It was relevant. Because I was like, you just can't attack. Because like you can just attack over my guy. Uh, Man, you all... Again, doesn't do anything without heart. Some, some phenomenal or orca stuff. If only you had main deck orcas I know. to play. Oh, my uh, triple underclock. Yeah, no, these The third matter. one doesn't really matter, but I have it just to have Pretty it. Unlucky with the sumo spirit. You only got one sumo yeah. spirit and you didn't get any of kendo spirits. Yeah, I didn't get any of the high scale spirit, and that's like the one you really want. Yeah. Rip me. Um, yeah, they're real. I got, I got Tindangle stuff. <laughs> yeah, that shit ain't happening. Gotta, gotta love that. Um, Fire Prison. I was really tempted to be Fire Prison Gaming. I was really tempted to be Fire Prison Gaming, but I was like... Uh, there, there is no gaming. What I do you do with this? It, uh, you just can't attack until you Link Summon. It turns off all your Ascended of Thunders. Well, uh, you know I'm, I can Link Summon like no tomorrow. You already know I have the Beavers. But then you only attack with one guy. You okay, attack with it's one true. Guy. So the idea behind Fire Prison would be like, oh, if I just want to sit on my Pinks as removal, but let you not actually threaten them with anything... Until you go into Agave Dragon. And also, it doesn't stop me from attacking. Wait, what? Monsters cannot attack except Link Monsters. Oh. Yeah, it's Mystic Mine Oh, at okay. Home. It's Mystic Mine at Home. Yeah, alright. Yeah. Oh, I also have the triple Heavy Storm Duster. I know. Oh my god. Yeah. If we society. were one of those series that was like out here banning cards, we all know I would be banning a card. <laughs> But we're mm -hmm. not those series. We're only a best of seven, anyways. Um, I don't think and uh, Herald of the Abyss is good. Some. I have double Herald of the Abyss, but I have a it's lot removal. of removal points to play with. Honestly, I probably should have been playing this over the cards that set because you're on Heavy Storm Duster. Possibly. Um, I guess I was too worried on you doing something similar to me, where if you have like two Earth dinosaurs out, it's like it doesn't actually hit the one that you want. Yeah. But. Maybe I just don't. Maybe I just shouldn't be worried about that because I feel like you can usually go battle phase and get over one of them, though, right? Yeah. Well, if you can't I get over one of them, then you're pretty happy to get rid of either. Over monsters! Oh my freaking gosh! Um, hmm. I have one copy of Hey True Nade to try to fight through back Relevant. row. Relevant, terrible. Um, I have two concentrating current as a battle trap. Kind of nice. And so that's it for the spells. Um, two cra Crusading Crawler. Yeah. I don't. Uh, they I, search a good card. I didn't have just generic linking stuff happening. Yeah. Um, and the world legacy card was all the hyper crawler stuff, and I got off. As you can see, I got off of the hyper crawler stuff. I was just on triple spine and dendrite. Right, you just search clash. Clash is just a good card. That's true. Yeah, it's just card. You, you just use crawler as extra copies of clash. Uh, but you have to be on a deck that can link summon. Like I was yeah, considering or like crawler want, or like wants the to only, link summon. Yeah, the only thing is I don't. I don't have any link threes I can make with it. Mm. You don't have a, a curious or a <laughs> I, dinosaur king. Team. You also wouldn't be able to make curious, right? Like the the classic move is uh, like normal beaver, make a link two, and then summon crawler to an arrow that the uh, link monster is pointing to to get your search, and then you make a link three. Yeah. So that that doesn't work for curious. It doesn't work for uh, full go for hire. Yep. Yep. Um, and then I don't think anything else I have... There can be only one! I have my one copy of There Can Be Only One. Showdown of the Secret... whatever. Oh, yeah. Showdown of the Secret Sense Scroll Type. I just did not read this card. I just did not read this card. I have to be honest about that. 
Uh, pretty, it's pretty neat. It's a pretty neat counter trap for. Uh, it is pretty niche. <laughs> uh, for Dino Wrestler Pankratops. Mm -hmm. um, two yeah, two Necrofusion for your uh, Draco Stelios. Yes, after I summoned the first uh, fusion monster, of course. Yeah, I, I got three Necrofusion, and I only have one Draco Spellia, but like, there's no other fusion monster to make first. Uh, there's um, the Cyberus monster, which takes two Cyberses, but it's a 2k guy, it's so bad, it's not worth it. Oh, uh, the Duplexer guy? Yeah, Duplex, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, I yeah, think these, that's these don't it anything. for... I think that's it for relevant cards, so... Primarily a bunch of... Uh, I got two Constraint cards for valid tricks, I got two Herald of the Abyss that I should probably have been running. Um... And I got a bunch of Dino Wrestler stuff. <laughs> I think that basically sums that up. Let's look at what you got. Do, 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 do. Okay. We got Alvis. Uh, go ahead and click. We got Alvis. Look at this guy. He does nothing. Mm. Air block. He does nothing. Two clock over. Relevant. Yeah. Suji, oh, uh, worse than Dogman. <laughs> yes, cause I mean you're just trying small. to link summon, right? I'm not trying to link summon. I'm trying to make it to my my link summons are to make like 2k guys or like 2400 guys. I could just make a Dogman instead. Oh. And so uh, I only have I only have Suchinoka though. I have no other dangers, so I oh, wish I had Dogman oh, instead. Uh, uh, five. You have more Happy Terrors than me. Wow, incredible. Oh, you also have the two Coep Raptor? Yeah, but they're not good. I only have the one time. So you're saying uh, if we get a guy that really likes having two level fours on the battlefield in the next set, you could also be running them. Mm -hmm. Fascinating. Yeah. Yeah, this guy. Anyways. Anyways. Um, uh, the one thing. Uh, wish I got... Good. If I got Candle, I could have done a Vendred build, but I didn't get any Candle. So, whatever. Because I pulled the rest of my uh, Vendred ritual spells and one extra uh, Revenge... Vendred Slayer out of my bonus five packs. Wild. And you can also search a Slayer off the field spell, so it's really easy. I could do that in a uh, Hydrolander build, mm -hmm. but alas, I do not have Candle. Oof. One Harp Horror. It's worth thinking about. I, I might end up playing it at some point. Uh, it's all right. I mean, do we have the other Orchists? Uh, I have one Brass Bombard. <laughs> no, uh, no symbol. No, no skeleton. No. Just mm. Bombard. Any any Galatea? No, just Bombard. Uh, I got Duo. Interest, uh, interesting ratio. I have Dragospelia. I have the mm. Diplexer. Like I said, you can Necrofusion it using uh, like Clock Wyvern and the Flame Admin that you make out of the Clock Wyvern. Mm. So it's an easy 2k guy to make with a Necrofusion. But like, I don't want to make a 2k guy that loses to all the Mech Knights. Uh, and then it turns your second Necrofusion to trigger Spellia, which is good, but it's just not worth the investment. Right. Got Titan. It's high Ooh. rarity. Can't make it. Ooh. I don't have any other Thunder Dragons besides Duo. Oh, yeah. Which doesn't activate in hand, so well, doesn't work at all. Yeah. Uh, likewise, Ascended also does not activate in hand, so it also doesn't yeah, work. Yeah, he just plops out. He just does the thing. I've got Spatha. We got Fogato. <laughs> yeah. We got this guy who I can't make. I got Galaxy Eyes, also high rarity. Also can't do anything with him. I could make him with Ascended Thunder, but he doesn't do anything. He's yeah, just worse. Yeah, Galaxy and Photon card. I got Long Gears, too. Woo-wee. Ooh, but no Galatea. Yeah, I only have exactly two Orcs as well, so that whole ban uh, returning to Banished Machine Monsters is not going to work. Womp womp. Very, very uh, much not. Helios are decent and very likely to be relevant oh, if we get any other main deck fires. You could, you could Any other main deck fires, plus Flame Admin does some decent shit with gear. This. Yeah. Uh, one Zombino is not bad. I do have the uh, World Chalice Link 1, so I can link him off and sometimes get you off guard removing a guy in specific com column. Yeah. Not terrible. Column shenanigans. I'll suit you care, whatever. Uh, Desmanian searches Nimble Beaver, unfortunately 1700, so not worth it. Yeah. Uh, Ghostbird, love him. Two Karate Spirit, decent. I tried out a penned list. All right. Because you get to still play with pens. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I can get like most of the deck to be pens here. Like it's it's reasonable. Uh, the only trick is you need to draw three pens, mm. two of which are the correct scales, to actually start doing pen value stuff. Right. And like the third thing that you start pen summoning has to be like the sumo spirits or the karate spirits. They have to be big enough to be relevant. Mm -hmm. uh, and that just isn't likely enough to make it worthwhile. Yeah. Uh, 
Actually, I do have green horizon. I didn't realize. My eyes glossed over them when I saw that they're small, so I stopped yeah, caring. So you have one move man. Two, one, I saw move man and yellow star and could not read these guys. These are yeah. simply beneath yeah. my nose. I think yellow star is a spell and trap removal one, isn't it? It is, but I'm good on that actually. Oh wait, really? Huh? You have, you have three copies of a super rare trap card. It's like really good to have. Three yeah, I mean, I could. I've got the MSC in the side specifically because yeah. like I. I feel like you just don't have enough backer for me to pop. <laughs> yeah, I, I specifically was like, I just can't run that much back row anymore. <laughs> World Shields, could have done it. Mm -hmm. eh. I think I only have two of the Crawler, which sends the grave anyway, so like, whatever. Yeah. Uh, love this guy, relevant for Hydrolander builds. Uh, it is, it helps yep. fuel your graveyard, it's decent, it's 2k, whatever. It's 2k uh, Auto Nav, Auto Nav, oh. actually really good. So you could I only try have one, to do FA stuff, actually. I have the field spells. I have like all the field spells, uh, but I don't have. I mean, I only have one auto nav. Is the problem? So yeah. Uh, these are just scales. They're bad scales. They're high rarity bad scales. Uh, one synchro, which is relevant for like auto nav and like oh, no, the singular tuner week. pen. Oh no! That means oh yeah, I'm going for more pen. Pinks. That's correct. That's what I'm doing. Oh, uh, that's these don't matter, these don't matter, none of these matter. 200 clock is sufficient, I only need yep. one, but two's are all right. Yeah. Uh, more pen stuff. Uh, this is good, this is a good card. If only I had like a second Harpoor or like uh, a symbol skeleton. A symbol. Or a Galatea. Or like a Galatea. <laughs> <laughs> yep. uh, then yep. that would be great. I have the one Sanctuary, if only we ever got Bay Links. Um, yep. One Dino Wrestling, it's simply not worth it to run only one. I can't out it, because you gotta set like a second field spell to get it in grave. Yep. Only one Herald would elect to have two, but eh, we'll outgrow it soon enough. It's alright. Yeah. Uh, Power of the Guardians, solid. One Boot Sector launch. It's interesting. I'm enticed. I'm thinking yeah. about it. It's a really good field spell limited. <laughs> I have three rockets total. You can just all infinitely like, summon rockets! <laughs> yeah. Uh, but I'd like to be able to search this. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, we got some FA field spells, which unfortunately not good enough. Test run, incredible, unbelievable card, unreal. Yep. It is very, very good. Just, just unfortunately, the FAs are in fact bad, and I only have one auto nav. If I had three auto nav, I'd run test run and I'd do an FA deck. Yeah, uh, test run's very powerful. <laughs> very good. Only one crawler, eh, it's all right. I didn't even end up running it in the link build, so you know it's all right. Searches clash, it's acceptable. When we get uh, decent link threes, or like we get like decent link fours, then it'll come up, and I will have wished that I got more. Uh, Thunder Dragon's Hundred Thunders is okay. Uh, it's some Jack Ascended to Thunder. It's just Monster Reborn. Yeah. It's like Monster Reborn, but it only works on Ascended to Thunder. Um, so, you know, that's why I'm not on it. Uh, Three Necrofusion, good. Uh, I'm interested in the future as soon as we get a decent. Uh, fusion, I can go into Draco's Valley stuff. Very good. Mm -hmm. uh, this, also good. Aww. Also Reborns, Ascend Thunder. Uh, I wasn't on it. Uh, I could have been... Really? I don't know, I think... Really? Yeah, I think Back to the Front is better. It's slightly more uh, oh, flexible. You just, you just run all right? three of them. No. That's too much. Like, look at all these guys who can't get summoned back by this. And look at, like... So I'm, I'm, if I summon Pank, I'm very happy. If I summon Thunder, I'm very happy. I'm never summoning back du out Duo because I'm not going to be able to get it out in the first place. Um, move Man, it's kind of mid. It's, what, it's okay. It's literally um, the World Legacy Secret with Move Man. It's a monster, two monster negates. Yeah. Are monster negates relevant? I guess. I guess that works. Yeah, because against cause, Pank, because Pank activates still on the field, even though he's treated for cost. Yeah, yeah, maybe next week. I, uh, I, showdown, I think good. That's a crazy card. And like you, you have uh, like the Goki's into Risk Scorpio, so like it, it can also just be it's a true. body. It can just be a body. It's just another Risk Scorpio. Yeah. Yeah. The next Risk Scorpio doesn't float though, because I don't have more Gokis. So. Yeah, but it's just a body. Just a body. I mean, and you do it's like running another Rescorpio, but worse, because I can't use it proactively. I have it's to like already have another Rescorpio. Rescorpio, but it could also be a Pank. Or an Ascended But pink. also it could be nothing, because I haven't drawn my Pank yet, and I haven't drawn my Rescorpio, because I'm still on this three-fourths of the deck. I, I thought your entire philosophy was you'd never draw cards in the bad order. No, my philosophy is that you never draw cards. <laughs> what? I simply will not find what? the garden, so I simply will not find the combo. So then just running the card's not even a problem then, you just don't draw it. 
So, like, this is a two-card combo. We don't draw the two-card combo. We don't believe in two-card combos. Mm. 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 Anyways. Um... Anything, is yeah, that, that's that it. it. That's, all, that's all I got. <laughs> oh, well then. Fascinating. Man. Oh, man. So that's it from this week. I mean, the, the results speak for themselves. So as the winner, which set would you like to try to get five more packs of? Man, I don't... Let's look at these packs. I, I don't even recall what's in them besides the Pankratops pack. I'm probably going the Pankratops pack. So five extra soul uh, fusion then? It's wait, we've got soul fusion and we've got extreme, uh, extreme force. Anything enticing. Uh, I guess I'll continue sharing my screen actually. Uh, sure, we'll keep, uh, uh, we'll keep looking. Anything at else it. in here? We can get No, nothing, nothing, nothing from there. We can get us all just kidding, we're not doing that. Uh, we could get. You could try I'd to be get happy Malakita to get. If you wanted to do the orchestra. Do little chimeras relevant? Uh, do little chimera. Uh, getting the extra rockets are relevant. Well, do little chimera actually ask you to have main deck fire monsters? It's true. Uh, fair enough. Uh, none of these matter. I could get more rare ghost birds. That's all right. Uh, oh, Soul Fusion says rare. I can get more harpoons. I could get. Mm -hmm. A symbol skeleton! I could get my third clock ribbon, which I'd be happy to play. And I believe Soul I, Fusion also has pink in it on the bottom. I can get the Galatea to make things work. I can get the other Dragon Duo to actually justify a Chaos deck. You could do get Dog Dogman, Man. Mothman to actually make the Chaos deck decent. Mm -hmm. uh, that doesn't work. Uh, Love you near also justifies thing. Thunderbird's great. Super rare though. Uh, pink. Pink of common. Pink of common. Mm -hmm. Pink of common. Yep. Uh, Panky Common. I we're taking Panky uh, Common. I, I think I think it's pretty here. Which which pack you? Yeah, we're, we're getting Panky Common. Yep. So five more copies of Soul Fusion then for you. Mm-hmm. And let's go ahead and look into the sets for next week. So the sets that we are able to pick from include and include and are limited to, different from what most game show hosts say. We can do Savage Strike, Dark Neo Storm. Rising Rampage or Chaos Impact. So let's just start going through them in order. Savage Strike. We got some stuff at Ultra Rare. At Rare, we get Rocket Synchron. We got Petting Cess, just a level four extender for if a card ever asks you to have two level fours on board. We get the first of the Charmer Links. Key to the Fire Charmer. Um, so if you were Pretty to do sick. fire Pretty stuff, you start stealing stuff from other people and it only asks you to have one main deck, uh, Deleter, I believe, is... No, it's 2 plus Cybers Monster, so it doesn't work with the Link guy you want. But... Stunlight Wolf also very it good. Is, it is just, um... It is Catastor for anything that's not a Link 3 or higher. So, you can just start running into stuff. Notably, different from Catastor, it is a once per turn on that effect. So it's kind of a lot worse. But, um... Yeah, so your opponent can out it reasonably. But then it also has a but This also is removal. It's also a second once per turn. So... Pretty good Link okay. Monster at Rare for removal Link stuff. Dark um, Factory More Production, also very, very good. Oh, Dark Factory More Production. Just getting the It's making that Hydrolander build relevant. Value you make it work. Yeah, it gets you, allows you to get those monsters in Grave. Um, super Rare, you have some good stuff you could try to get if you're doing Guard Dragon shenanigans, I guess. Oh yeah, we can go Aggravate for sure. Yeah. Other than that, it doesn't Super Rare doesn't have a whole lot for us. Secret Rare is another high roly slot. At the yeah, the extra is crazy if you ever get it, you know. Yeah, common slot. We have a couple salads. Uh, I don't think we Got have it. a target for connector, so that's not relevant. Um, I don't actually know what the main deck guard dragons do. Um, they're extenders they're bad. for normal monsters if you link summon. I mean, we have some normal two K guys. We have the world chalice synergy as well. It could come up. So. Yeah, the, you, it could come up. Could come up. Uh, the Orcus Nightmare at common, if you have... I have a Harpoor. If I get more Harpoor, I can yeah. play it. If you have Harpoor, Orcus Nightmare goes so freaking hard, it's not even funny. And then, oh no, this is, uh, series turns around again. I believe this Cataclysmic guy actually does something. If a fire you control is destroyed, you special summon it, and then you deal damage to your opponent. 
If they out one of your uh, fire guys, you have a 2600 guy that pops out. Unfortunately, it's less attack than Ascendant of Thunder. It ties with Pankratops, but if you're on a fire strategy, just good stuff thing, it's a fire guy that just does fire things. I mean, you don't need to be on a fire strategy. If you're on like the Clockwork Rings to make the uh, Administrator, you can reasonably get a fire. Or if you have like Key to the Fire Charmer, you can reasonably get a fire out from your extra deck. Yes. If you also have easy link fires to make, and you're interested yeah. in making them often enough where him sitting in hand is not a problem. Yeah. Uh, aloof loop time for exactly. He has one of the worst. If people are in Metaphys. Uh, I don't think either of us have a good Metaphys core, so. Uh, it doesn't have to be just Metaphys. You can banish the Thunder Dragons. Your one Thunder Dragon. You can target one of your banished monsters out at you. Yes, if you're on Thunder Dragons, you can also get their banished effects. That is true. That is true. Other than that, like, it technically allows you to tutor any monster from your deck with matching... Wait! I can use this to tutor Pinkratops! It's true. And then... Yeah, all it costs is a 1700 normal summon. Then I can summon it back off of Zombina to add back the n guy that I banished from my hand. Ooh. More guys that make Zombina less bad and support... The, the idea is how fast are we power creeping out of my Pankratops control strategy, though. I think we're power... Oh, we don't. We don't power creep out of Pankratops. But, that doesn't happen. But me <laughs> running all the other support cards to try to Pankratops a million Oh, times. the Zombinas, we already have power creep that. That's already wah, out. Wah. You I missed your shot. I think this guy does... Extra Ceratops is actually a warrior monster, so... Never mind. That is whack. Uh, Shiranui Synchros, I don't think... like They are they're, generic. They are generic, they're generic synchros, synchros for the sake of it, but their stats are not good if you're using them as generic Synchros. Yeah, if you're uh, just using them generically, their stats are not great. Yeah. Yeah, that is correct. <laughs> uh, Cypress Integrator, if you needed a bridge, I believe that's all it does. Yeah, and then it summons yeah. a tuner from Hand or Grave, and you knew that. Uh, update Jammer. We can start doing oh. Update Jammer killing people. Yeah. Cyber's Wicked, very good. Cyber's Wicked is also easily available to me by Clock Wyvern. Yeah. And then I can crawl her to this. Cannot be destroyed by battle or card effects. I just can't out it with pain. Yeah. If I go Clock Wyvern, make Wicked, summon Crawler, search Clash, and then also uh, banish Wyvern from Grave to add a Cyber's Tuner from deck. I don't know what I'm searching, but I like cards. Cards are good? That's a lot of value. Yeah, Update maybe. Jammer... Are there any mm. Cybers tuners you're naturally running? Uh, not right now. Alright, so you need that to get all the value. Um, but update jammer is just like he allows. I don't you know to what you can make out of this. Is there other things we can make? I think the detonate deleters a cyber slink three. Yeah, so it's like uh, you can just attack directly. Yeah, twenty one hundred. Yeah, you attack directly for 4,200, I guess. Yeah. Alright, sure. It also just has its own effect on field. Um, if your cyber sponsor battles, negate all other effects on the field to the end of the damage step. Damage calculation uses original attack and defense, and then when the opponent's monster is destroyed, you deal them an extra 1,000. So, like, you just... It's not you, trivial to make update jammer, though, because you can't make it off clock wyvern because uh, you level need one token? higher level stuff. Yeah, level 1 token. Mm, yes. There will probably be tools for it coming out. Um, so, if you're on the Necrofusion stuff, you can do Clock Lizard shenanigans. Uh, you can. You shouldn't. But if you were, you're good. Uh, Shiranui, Incantation stuff, Edge of the Ring is like... No. Nope. Um... Time Thief Redeemer Oh my comment? god! <laughs> Child's Play is really funny for you. That's I gain funny. life points, and then I can't... <laughs> oh, that is kind of nuts, actually. I'm not saying it's good, but it's kind of funny. Uh, so I start at 8k, I gain the 2k... I gain the... Yeah, yeah I gain the 2k <laughs> difference off my first Ascent of Thunder, and then I'm at 10k immediately. Yep. And then I just can't attack over your guys. Until I out the Child's Play. And notably, I don't have the Triple Heavy Sword Duster to out it, so I still have to main deck the MST and the... And, and the tank tops and the whatever the um the normal monster pendulum was that we had and Pank well if i'm using pow tops to out your child's play i think you win the game right <laughs> at least morally Perhaps. You win the game 
Um, summon over is like the worst floodgate, I believe. Yep. <laughs> Definitely not gonna be useful in our series. And then the card I have been hyping up this whole time! Time Thievery Doer! Time Thievery is very available. This is very, very, very good. Uh, we also have Regulator at Common, which is crazy. Yes! Which is Regulator also common. crazy. And then we have Time yeah. Thievery Doer! And then, and then we have some, gen some generic Time Thief names to summon off Regulator, I guess. Yeah, Bezel Ship and Winder are both at Common as well. You have flyback in order to attach spells yeah. to it if you want to do the time thief hack. Not worth it. You just use flyback to attach another copy of flyback. Just to redo is always an interruption. And then because we're both on spells and traps, he'll just incidentally get tons of value and he's going to be amazing. And time thief redoer. Anyways, you know, ama amazing rank four. And that's why I was talking about the dinos, the two bad dinos. If you go for yeah. your normal summon well, it, and then if your opponent tries to just attack it with one guy, it goes to defense and face summon another, and then you rank four into Redoer. It's not good, but that's why I was pointing it out. Anyways, now that I've gone on my little Redoer thing, that is Savage Strike. Time Thieves at Common. Crazy. Dark Neostorm. Uh, secret oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You skipped Guru. <laughs> but what are we going to do Guru Control with? Uh, is there literally any other Guru name, or Subterra name? There's or like single Subterra one? Subterra Succession in the same pack, but this guy was legacy support for Subterras. We don't have the final oh, dang. battle. Oh dang. Like, if we had final battle, then it's like, oh yeah, he's just a guy that's gonna always be massive. Massive stats, but we don't have that. Well, alright. Okay, Neostorm. Womp womp womp. Yeah. Neostorm at Secret Rare, you get Cherubini, you win the game. Um, something you get like Avermax, you win the game. You get Avermax, you win the game, because then it's just turbo at Avermax. You uh, get notably... Avermax, and then you make Agave, I guess. Very funny, but not that impressive. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm just going to out your Agave with my Avermax. Uh, at Rare, we have, I think, World Legacy, Guard Dragon, Marduk is like a payoff for a ton of normal monsters. It's Yo, like, we uh... got Philo. That's a fur hire I can summon off Fulgo. Uh, yes, Philo is a fur hire. You can summon off a of Fulgo. Just for the, just for that added value. Unless you're linking him with a winged beast. But I don't think you were on any other winged beasts at the time. Yeah. Um, other good link four. Amphibious sw swarm ship and blow whale. Very Two good. Two attack for each link in the graveyards, both yours and mine. And then if it's destroyed, you can summon back a link through your lower. And then if a link through your lower is popped, you can banish it from the grave to pop another card. So it's a big Link 4 that like floats into value, and then if you destroy what it floated into, it gets to pop a thing. Really pretty good Rank 4 to make, Link 4 to make. Probably immediately outs um, Agave as like the Link 4, because I think I think this guy is just... He's a little harder to make since you can't use normal monster tokens, but like you can always fold the normal monsters into anything else. And you even want uh, to... Almarduke is actually good. Uh, Marduk? Yeah, Almarduk. Or Almerduck? Oh, you're talking about World Chalice. The World's Chat Yeah, World Chalice Guard Dragon. Uh it's uh, something that we can I can easily make through Necrofusion and the Clock Rivers and the Nimble Beavers. Mm -hmm. And then it's like a 3k guy, which is acceptable. And then I make Drago Spellia after you kill it. Can attack all bad. monsters your opponent controls once each. One attack is declared involved in this card and opponent's link monster. You can match one link monster with the same link rating. Eh, the the text doesn't matter. It's 3k. <laughs> uh, being able to attack all monsters once each isn't bad. You could it can really easily bad. clean up it's a board. Okay. Um, Glassy Flay isn't coming up. Yes. Oh, God. They give Dino Wrestlers Synchro Summon stuff. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, Dino and this is crazy in a world where you exist with weathers. We do not live in that world. Oh, oh, weather, weather rainbowed canvas? Yeah. No. Yeah, yeah. Only, only side set pack there. Um, super rares, we have Crackdown. Crackdown gonna be a map. Um, oh Crackdown Unreal. You get Heavy uh, Storm Duster and I don't! <laughs> Whitefish Salvage is also an unreal card if we have any fish that are worth playing. Oh yeah, Whitefish Salvage? Yeah, it's infinite value. It's it's infinite value to hand, though. Yeah. So it's like, it's, it infinite has to be value. like a fish that can like free extend itself, right? That's the yeah, or just a good fish. <laughs> it has to be more than the 2k fish. It has to be a good fish. Yes, but like, it needs to have a lot of relevant effects to qualify as a good fish. Mm -hmm. We have Mystic Mine. Maybe I just get triple Mystic Mine and I just try to Mystic Mine you out of the game. 
until you get all your heavy storm dusters. Anyways, <laughs> uh, the crescendo is now here. So if you end up pulling the Galatea, your Orcus pulls could be really good. I mean, we're not getting that as super. I mean, we're praying for Crackdown, but we're going to get exactly one Memories of Hope. That's that's what's happening here. I mean, no, we, we're guaranteed a super rare every pack. Oh, okay, so I'm going to get like 12 Memories of Hope? Sick. Yes, you're going to get 12 Memories of Hope. Good, good. I can pick up a couple of Fusion Destinies too, for all my main deck D heroes. Yeah, hey. We already know we might get, well, actually the way the series is going, we might not get to Sprite, because I'm getting smashed, <laughs> but if we get to Burst yeah. of Destiny, you could, oh my god, if we DPE, oh my gosh, <laughs> whoo, that would be wild. Um, ultra rare stuff is ultra rare stuff, Ding Greerster is crazy if you get it, and then if you get it, it's like, oh my god, what are we, what are we supposed to do? Firewall Guardian requires a Link 1 in the first place, but then he's also just a normal summon Link 2. I don't know if we have a Link 1 for Firewall Guardian yet. We don't have a cyber swarm but we do have the normal uh monster link one yeah because we don't have we, we skipped over the um the guys that point up point down what are they i don't know i don't know they were they're running in cybers elf which i forget their name but if we had someone like that he'd be a guy and then he like negates an attack if, if yeah, he right, somehow sure. if he somehow stays in the graveyard except we're just extending to banish him um Grid Sweeper is like no, it's like no, it's bad. Graveyard value for removal, not no. Really. You banish a Link monster you control it is bad. Oh man, is there any Link monster that gets value when it's banished? Not that I can think of. Uh, Fennec is not one of the good ones. Overflow Dragon, fine, fine. It's not so, Dino Wrestlers. I was trying to read these guys because I was like, you know, my Dino Wrestler stuff is happening. But, so, the Dino Wrestlers have like this really, as, a, as we were all talking about before, it's basically get the Stigo guy in Grave because then this guy gets to also summon him back out from the graveyard during the, um, mm -hmm. if you end up special summoning a guy because he bounces to hand, summon the guy back out of the grave, guy special summons from Grave and another guy to hand. So it's like, there's so much value there, but I just have to somehow set it up correctly. Uh, Colicent is just a extender. He, yeah, he's just an extender if you want a level two extender, if you're like playing Sprite or something. He also technically makes the Synchro guy, but I don't think the Dino Wrestler Synchro guy is where it's at. Um, this guy's level five and he only has 1600 attack points. So he's just not good. He's like a Colicent. Yes. Correct. He's like a Kalut, kind of, but also like not. He's like there. a Kalut you can't summon. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he has to be there because, he has to be in the graveyard because you discarded him during that turn, and you control more monsters than me, he summons back from grave, but like, that's like so hard to set up. Draw hand for your uh, Destiny Fusion package, because you need to have mm -hmm, one of those. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, we don't have Assault Mode activated, so Assault Sentinel doesn't work. Neo Flamble Lady is not Fencing Fire Ferret, I believe. Uh, yes, it is not Fencing Fire Ferret, so not too relevant. Deus X Crawler. If I uh, had the, um, yeah. if I had the World Legacy card in Graveyard that was like, banish it to flip a guy face up, I could try to do Deus X Crawler locking. It's pretty good if you get to pull it off, but it really requires more cards than what I have. I just don't have the cards for it. Uh, I think Cloud of the Storm Serpent's like a Banish of Fire and Wind to just be an extender guy. So if you're on a Fire Wind deck, it's a Fire Wind extender. I mean, I there's a couple decent wins. I think that we don't have any good main deck fires. Yeah. We can use the extra deck fires if we get like if you get Hita, or you can use I can use Clock Wyverns for the Flame Admins. That's all right. Does this is this worth it? Does this do a thing? Who knows. It outs a guy with a by banishing a fire. Do you mm -hmm. need more fires? That's on it. Oh, okay. banishes multiple. Things. Okay, maybe. I'll consider it. Yeah. A uh, slid dolphin is a sea serpent. Not fish. A fish. It's not a fish. It's not a fish. It's a sea serpent. It's a it's a mammal. It's a dolphin. Yes, but it's a sea serpent. <laughs> Wild. Hand gallop. No. Um, Emperor Mahu Garza is like the biggest investment guy for a big guy, but terrible. He also says you can never activate a battle trap, but you have to tribute three guys. We can't do that. That ain't happening. Um, more incantation stuff if you're doing that. 
a dino wrestler that I first have to make a dino wrestler link for. So it's like, oh no. Not happening. We do, there is a link to dino wrestler in this set. So it's like, eh. If I activate world dino wrestling while he's on the field, I can add pinker tops from grave to hand. Yep. Eh. Overall, not the most amazing. We have a link. We have our first uh, rank three Xyz. We finally have some link to Gokis. Yeah. Oh, they're still not. Uh, no, oh, I'm sorry. The link, link threes lied. Yeah. yeah, I can't play those. <laughs> yeah, these are both link three. Uh, Puzzle Mino, another generic link two. He does like level manipulation stuff though, so less useful than Underclock. But he's a generic link two that's a light. It, if you were doing sometime, stuff. yeah, it can it can pop a guy. Mm -hmm. It's only 1300 though, kind of whack. Yeah, a little small. <laughs> Tyrant Dino Fusion. <laughs> only work. fusing using monsters you control is fusion material. <laughs> Wild. Card Dragon Reincarnation is not terrible. Uh, That's playable. It's Necrofusion. It's Necrofusion for exactly the link. Yeah, that are uh, all link monsters. Monster. Yep. But any miracle fusion, uh oh, from your feet yeah, field or graveyard, so Yeah, it's it's Necrofusion at home. Yeah. For summoning the thing that you want to summon. You can also activate it, you know, from hand during the day, the battle phase. So it's like you can hide like the surprise lethal. Mm -hmm. Dude, I want I want us to both have triple mirror force so badly. <laughs> I want us both have triple mirror force so badly. <laughs> Anyways, um, Thanatosis is a field spell for incantations. If you're doing that stuff, um, stand in very funny. I will be taking your pancreas. Oh, with stand in. Yeah, stand in very funny. Not great, but very funny. I'll, I'm not opposed. So if you control an Earth Dino, you contribute it to get back pink. Yeah. Yeah, very funny. Oh, uh, one non-link monster you control, and one link monster your opponent controls. So this is happening. something that I could actually use because you true. you like link summoning. I don't like links, or I well, don't like like is a strong word, a but but yeah, I'll do it. I'll, I'll link. <laughs> I, 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 you're running triple beaver in your deck because <laughs> I like beavers. Oh yes, not what they make, just the beavers. No, I mean, I guess I like starfish, too. They're kind of sick. Yeah, I'm a water deck at heart. Um, Saryuja's Shackles is not card advantage unless your opponent makes a link three. So they have to make a link three first, and then it's like a really interesting card cycle. Magical card, Mallet. But you need, your opponent needs <laughs> Magical to Magical Mallet at home. Requires your opponent to make a link three first. Uh... And then there are other cards that I might try to read one day. <laughs> no. Uh, I don't think there are other cards that I'm going to try and read. Fair enough. So that's Dark Neo Storm. Rising Rampage. Secrets. Secret rares are secret rares. We could Apollosa Negate. Wild. Wow. Uh, um, Coral Anemone also relevant question mark? I don't know. I don't think you make anything actually out of that. Mm -hmm. uh, in the rare are all of the Tenny monsters. Tenny monsters are actually really huge. Vashuda yeah, plus, Vashuda Vashuda plus Monk is crazy. Uh, even uh, Shithana is actually really nice yeah. too, because we have some normal monsters that are playable. Yeah. So, like, overall, Tenny monsters are going to be really good, especially to support the normal monster stuff. Could be sweet. Flawless Protection plus Vessel of the Dragon Cycle. Again, if you just get a bunch of Tenny monsters, or even just Flawless Protection if you're just like, you can use I it have for, uh, stuff too. 2k normal summon. You just set monsters and you play some kind of uh, Flawless perfect Perfection Control. You don't need the Tennies. Yeah, just if I just have triple Flawless Protection, I just like Flawless Protection, set a monster. If you summon anything, I draw two new cards. Yeah. Yeah, we could see it. We could see that happening. You do special summon, except you now have a normal summon 2300. Oh my god. <laughs> now? Um, I've, I've always said that. I had the Rescorpios. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. You've always had the Rescorpio. A Link Mail Archfiend is another Link 4 that we get. He is... He requires more commitment than the other ones, because you have to make a ritual uh, Wait, you, you skipped over Prail the Desperate Doom Eagle. Well, that's uh, Doom Eagle's only. But he sees play in Tri Brigade, and we will reach Tri, Br Tri Brigade in the series. Oh, you're right. We will reach. Uh, you're right. You're right. You're yeah. Right. Fair. You're right. You're right. 
Uh, likewise, Win is also relevant. Yes, Win Charmer. I forgot. I, I, Win I, I can make off Clock Wyvern very easily. Yeah, or if you're on Nahata. Indeed. Yes. Um, There's some super rare stuff. Who cares about super rares? That that Storm's ain't Dragon Return is like a back to the front, but for banished monsters. So if you're if you happen to be on Orcus in any capacity, you can get back Orcus monsters. I think White Howling is like. Uh, White Howling's all right. Yeah, I'll, all I have. Us. Yeah, I have Beavers. I have the Star Boy. I have um Muscle Medic, which is also a water. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's reasonable to play White Howling, I think. Yeah, just gives you uh, some blanket spell negating. In the it comments, doesn't beat like Clash though, because it doesn't beat damage stuff stuff. Yeah, I have to do it preemptively. Pre it. Yeah. We got two other dinos. I'm pretty sure these guys are both bad because I think I gave them a little look over. Yes. Yes, these guys were yes, yes. They were both bad. Okay, cool. We have the Wind Cataclysmic guy. So if you pop a Wind Monster, they get a free 2600. And allows you to place any spell or trap card from the field on top of the deck. So it's like, lets you temporarily out some stuff. Again, if you make like a Link to Wind or you just are running a bunch of Wind Monsters, having big guys that hop out for free are pretty good. Um, Magic Calabra lets you manipulate levels for like Xyz summons or Synchro summon stuff, not hyper relevant there. Defender is if you're on a ton of normal monsters, because then it can give a 500 attack boost to all non-effects, uh, and then it floats into a non-effect monster, which is both Monk of the Tenny, Berserker of the Tenny, and Defender of the Labyrinth. I completely did gloss over that Berserker of the Tenny is just like a generic Link 3 we can make. That's 3k attack. That is really good, actually. Hold on. That yeah. makes Crawler good. Yeah, that's like... Crusadian like, Crawler. Yeah. Yeah, it's like it's like really good. It's, like, it's make, really good. Make a Link 2, really. uh, Crawler into it, you get, you get a 3k guy. 3k guys are really big. 3k guy and Clash, yeah. Baba Baba Barber, I think, is the first true generic Link 2. Other than that, uh, it's not... Oh, well, I guess, yeah. It's not super relevant. Like, it can be any two monsters, so even two tokens of the same name. So, like, if you're trying to, I guess if we ever got scapegoat or something, but it's also a dark for chaos shenanigans, but I think Underclock Taker mostly serves the role for that. Uh, Yosenju. Raptor is a recruiter who is a dinosaur. I don't know if you care about dinosaurs. <laughs> beat Raptor? Is there anything that actually cares about dinosaurs? You can special summon one Beat Raptor from your deck. But yeah, it's just a hard once Raptor. per turn, recruiter, though. It's a hard once... Yeah, Why? you can only use this effect of Beat Raptor once per turn. We thought Tomato was too good, so we made it summon only Tomatoes, and only one Tomato. And only one Tomato per turn. It's like, it's like such a sad recruiter. But, if we were on a million Time Thief Redoers, then just having a guy that floats into a level 4, maybe it's worth it. Who knows? Probably not. Um... Barricade Board Blocker. This one I am really looking forward to because it gives me a free discard outlet for the World Wrestling stuff. I'm not actually going to be like adding back the World Wrestling unless we're in a really weird game state, but the biggest thing is me wanting to get it out of hand. That's why the Regeki Break was so crucial in all those moments, but Generic Link 2 like, is a free discard outlet. Pretty useful. Pretty useful for what it's trying to do. Some of these trap cards probably do something. If you open them, you probably give them a read, but... That's what we're looking at there. And then Chaos Impact. He gives us the Unchained Twins, some Gladiator Beast support. Gives us a Shuna. Um, wait, wait, wait. Before you move on, uh, Mankin Cat is very relevant, both for the future sprite, but also just because we have... I have three Beaver. Mannequin Cat. Yes, you do It's just have a 2k beaver. guy we make instead. That, that's a big right. improvement over the Star Boy. And also then, what, I summon my Pankertops because you have a Pankertops. Or like, you know, yeah. I summon my pink because you have any dino, earth dino on field. Yep, yep. If I special, if you force me to special summon any earth dino or I just have to special summon one, Anakin Cat will just get you pink tops and you get your one pink tops in rotation and it's pretty Kinda good. Nice. Kind of sick. Yeah, and it's that common. Kind of good. Uh, the Chaos Impact are the Unchained Twins, Gladiator Beasts. Uh, Ashuna quite nice. Of course, you need the other ten but... I think we have anything for the Hoppier Squadron, but yeah, for Ashina, you you need to have the Rising Rampage being picked. Uh, Jelly Cannon. 
Jelly Cannon very good? Jelly Cannon is really good for what we're looking at here. Um, notably, it's really bad against Pink specifically, but yeah. Is it really bad? Oh yeah, it is really yeah, bad. It's I, not I it. attack yeah. with Pink, you Jelly Cannon, and I pop something else. <laughs> um, I think that secret. No, that's just. Uh, what? Safer, it's unreal. Uh, and like unchained or cool, but you have to have other unchained. So whatever. yeah, so you have to pull a lot of the guys in the rare slot. Yeah. Um, super rare. I think the prime miner. If monsters suffer from your opponent's hand or deck to the graveyard, you can on this card for hand defense position. When this card is flipped face up, you can target two cards in the field, destroy them. <sighs> so I definitely, if we were in this pack, I definitely don't run the um, the uh, what's his name. The Crawler Dendrite, but Prime Mineral Congrate does punish foolish burial stuff. Like if you're on a on Orcus stuff, I guess. But if you pull off Prime Mineral Congrate, it's pretty good. Mm -hmm. If it pulls off, it's pretty good. It just flips someone, pop two things. That's a pretty good flip effect. Um, at Ultra, there's some crazy stuff, but it's at Ultra, so you know. I think it I Striker would be unreal. I get Striker. I already have the one field spell to search. Crazy. Striker Dragon. It oh, yes, yes, an ultra rare Striker Dragon. Yes, that'd be crazy. Yeah. And someone getting Draco Berserker of the Tenny would also be crazy. It's a very good Synchro to make. A little, a little more complicated to make that because, you know, Synchros, but. Yeah, Striker Dragon would be crazy. Crazy for you. Mm -hmm. For some reason, they print a level 8 vanilla. I don't know why, but they do. Uh, we've got vanilla support, you know. For like level 8 vanillas? Uh, is it a dragon? No, it's, no, it's not cyber, a dragon. Okay, we don't then. Uh, there's Galactic Spiral Dragon with the Nebula Dragon up here if you're trying to rank 8 turbo things. Specifically, are all, light the, or dark are all the Dino Wrestlers bad after the first printing of Dino Wrestlers? Yeah, I think it was only that one level 6 I was looking at that seemed reasonable. All the other ones are like very specific um, like battle tricks. Actually, wait. When a post module clears the tag, you can banish this. You can banish this card from your graveyard. Add one Dino Wrestler monster from your deck to your hand. Okay, this card can let me search Pinker Tops. <laughs> so, if I wanted to use this guy for more recruiting of the good Dino Wrestlers, um, you gotta get him in grave though. Yeah, and then this yeah. guy is just like an extender for Dino Wrestlers, so it's not super super great. I mean, he has a effect that allows you to discard him for free. Um. It prevents my guy from being destroyed by the battle. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, world key doesn't get in the hairball. Anything. Brutal dozer. We don't have any of the other Infinitrax stuff. Um, Burning star doesn't do anything. This guy also doesn't do anything. Luna the Dark Spirit is a level four dark extender for if you're doing time thief redo or shenanigans, or you're just trying. Uh, to counterpoint: You have to have darks to banish. We don't have darks to banish. Uh, but you have when you have more time thieves, you have more darks to banish. Uh huh. You, you uh -huh. Banish your regular. So we're gonna make time thieves so we have darks to banish to make our time thieves. Yeah, you just end on like triple triple redo. What's the problem? Mm -hmm. It's not like he's a hard once per turn or anything. Mm -hmm. um, patrol plane is like old DD banished stuff. Allows you to special summon it. I mean, in a world where I get the other Thunder Dragon duo, maybe we consider it. That's a strong. That's, that's that actually a very strong, weak maybe. maybe. This isn't. Yeah. Protocol Gardena is not <laughs> not a thing. It's a. I guess it's a go 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 golem. You could link summon. Uh, yeah, I think Seraphim sure Papillion is. is technically a generic Link Three. It is yeah. a yeah, it's a generic thing. I'd be happy to play. It, yeah, yeah, just make it out of Crawler. Anything to make Crawler work. Like if we if we pass over the Rising Rampage, it's like probably the next best generic Link Three we got. Because if it you gets make it one with counter, because you use Crawler, yeah, if you make it with the Crawler, <laughs> it's a twenty-three. Wow! 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 Uh, Marinsa stuff, which would be uh, cool, but I don't think we're going to get enough Marinsa to actually yeah. do things. We got Desert Locust to common for the Hoppier. Uh, Desert Locust, yep. You let us rip a card. Uh, uh, Prime there's Mineral, Prime Mineral to punish me for the heavy Storm Dusters. I could, tr I could try. 
Uh, then you can add one monster from your graveyard to your hand, except for Man Strong. I would have to figure out something yeah. to do with it, though. I mean, you you add some Pankratops, or you add some monster, it's fine. It's a 3k defender. Yeah. How do I get over 3k defenders? I don't know, you, you kind of did it without problem, <laughs> these games. Without a problem? I spent a card, I spent a valuable... Uh, like yeah, battle trick on that. The, the the thing I need my three K defenders to do is make you skip like three turns, not make you spend cards. <laughs> I need them to be unoutable, not spend a card to out it. <laughs> mm. But we're just not in that phase of Yu-Gi-Oh anymore where that exists. We are in the future, dude. This is this is just wildly different from the five Ds era, and like I'm still trying to wrap my head around it. It's like <laughs> so wildly different. But, because you won, which of these four lovely packs would you like to pick for us to draw from for next week? Well, you see, I hate decisions, and I don't know what I want. Um, like, I, I really don't have any strong synergies to go after, because my, my game plan really is Ascend to the Thunder until it stops being good. Yeah, That's really all I got. I don't have Dino Wrestlers, I don't have tuners i um <laughs> i've got the nimbles i could go for the mannequin cat and that's all right like having that is is some nice flexibility because then you try and summon your pancreas to out it and then i summon my pancreas yep they're the definitely uh, Uh, what else can we get out of this? Very little. Uh, exceptionally li little. Uh, I'm not- I'm not jazzed about any of these packs, really. Understandable, uh, you can I try don't to- want to- You can just try I don't to want to give you Berserker of the Tengi, because you have more Crawlers than me. More, um, Crusadia Crawlers than me. Yes, I have two Crusadia Crawler. Yeah. That's one more than me. Uh, mm. I think I will go with Does that do anything? That doesn't do anything. Uh, we'll go with Rising Rampage. Because it is a pack with rel you know, a relatively bonus little bonus value to you, right? Like we, we, everyone loves tennies. Yep, both of us will definitely love tennies, and I I certainly don't love uh, Marshall Anklio or Ram Brachio, I'll say that. Yeah. Alright. I do enjoy the barricade blocker, but you also get the mannequin cat, so that could be worrying. Huh? Our pulls are like very different this time around. It's 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 kind of it's kind of nice. Um, if you're picking the rising rampage, then I think that means I just go for. I have to stop thinking of giving myself the illusion of I got something happening. I don't think I want to give you the detonate deleter. The detonate deleter I think is like actually like pretty good for you. I am better at making link threes yeah. in general. Outside of the crawler, I have, I just have more normal summons who make stuff. Mm -hmm. As well as I have the back to the front fronts that you don't have. Right. Um, Marshall Anglia ends the battle phase? I mean, I guess. Ah, oh, man. It's a way for me to end the battle phase that doesn't lose to Heavy Storm Duster, at least. I mean, I don't know why you're talking about things in Rising Rampage. You're getting Rising Rampage, no, no matter I'm what. Talking about, you know? oh, this is a card in Dark Neo Storm. 
Oh, uh, Marshall Anglio. Marshall Anga. <laughs> Anga. I don't actually know what an Anga is, to be fair. Yeah, I think, man. Is it really this pack? Because we have the Amplio, who, like, mildly actually helps me search out more pinks. There's a Papillion. I guess I could try to do Fire Prison Cauldron of the Old Man. <laughs> I don't think you can. I think I have Heavy Storm Duster for that. Yeah. What I need is to just just pretend that card doesn't exist. You just won't draw it. I simply won't draw it. I mean, to be fair, I didn't draw it uh, the first week, right? I just didn't see it. Yeah. Oh, man. Um... As hype as I was for my Redoer man, I just don't think I my pool currently supports Redoer better than yours. So I think I'm just gonna choose Chaos Impact. Uh, All so right, Chaos Impact it is. Yeah, so we're doing Rising, we're doing Rising Rampage and Chaos Impact. Which I'm getting one a bonus Soul Fusion, and you're more, getting bonus. Which one, one do I want more packs of? Do I just want more Tennies? I could just get five more packs. It's gonna potentially be like five more tennies, maybe. Chances for Berserker yeah. of the tennies, so I can actually make a link three guys. Bonus Shatana, bonus Vishuda. Uh, mm -hmm. Her is not great. Nahat is good. Uh, Edhara doesn't do anything unless you actually have like synchros yeah. or ways to ban. Uh, yeah, or or bonus ways. To, actually, I guess the, the benching doesn't matter. I would, yeah, I just could pick won't five more that. packs of Chaos Impact if I really believed in the Dino Wrestler meme dream. I don't really believe in it that much. Um, so I think I'm just gonna, yeah, I think I just pick five more Rising Rampage. So yep. just to mark it down, we're gonna pick twelve Rising Rampage. Venner Zap gets plus five for losing, and then twelve. Of Chaos Impact. And that's going to be what it is for next week, everybody. So, that is it for Pick and Pack Yu-Gi-Oh! Week 2. Blade Wolf, you have anything you want to say to everybody? Um. Well, my first... The Week 1 polls were, like, pretty great uh, with Ascend to Thunder. I think that, like, your Week 2 polls just greatly outclassed mine, and this is generally going more even like panker tops and stuff to summon panker tops are going to go crazy as we go forward yeah that, that, that was my plan for this week but i probably just have to tune it in and be more disciplined with how my panker tops plan works mm. <laughs> it's gotta be more disciplined with it but that is it for this week guys the Vendor's app is going to turn around. Vendor's app is going to turn around and pull it all together. And you guys are going to see. You guys are going to see it. But as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Check us in next week at the same time. Maybe 30 minutes earlier. Maybe an hour earlier. No, around the next week, around the same time. And I will see you guys all then. So as always, please have a wonderful time. And take care. See you all then.